Sometimes you do need to let go and forgive yourself for that painful moment, mistake, trauma, drama of that past that prevents you from moving forward. So you see, understand, when you use hypnosis and NLP, it helps you let go of those painful feelings and moments. You must shift the way you feel about that past mistake. So to somewhere you feel more neutral and different. And when you think about it, it doesn't really bother you. You are truly indifferent about it. By talking about that painful, bad memory, you will always keep the problem. And you just talk yourself into keeping the problem. NLP have useful presumption that helps you move forward. And one of that is this. People respond to the map of reality, not to reality itself. NLP is the science of changing your internal map, your map of reality to what you see, feel, and hear, and you think about the world around you. The map of reality is your internal map inside your head. You know, hey, simply put, we are referring to the harsh dialogue inside your head and the images and how you think about that memory it's all distorted now memory it's stored in the brain like a warp time machine of distorted facts with intense feelings simply put your memories of your childhood feelings are accurate to you but when you remember it now it's an overblown childhood feeling that's inaccurate and an overblown tall tale of it now, humans have an inaccurate and delusional viewpoint about memories. And it's not accurate because your mind will delete, distort, and generalize that stimulus and that trauma that create maybe some drama in your life. Now, there is a saying in self-help that the answer is always inside of you. The answer is really how you feel about doing what you need to do in a more resourceful state, in a more resourceful food mood. So when you take action to get what you want, talking is just trash talking. And the more you trash talk in your mind, the more you will cave in believing it, meaning your goals are just trash. So then now come back to who you really are. Come back. When you use hypnosis, you change your mood to be in grateful, joyful, you expect things to happen and things will truly happen. So then you then become an action word and you build faith in what you believe that is true and then true to you. Our brains sorts out and code our experience in many ways. And it what we see, feel and hear. So then to change that painful moment, then you must then change the way you see to either, if it's an unpleasant feeling or a memory, make it small, make it dim, and then move it away from you. And then if it's a pleasant experience, then make it bright, make it big, and make it so that you can then just feel or let go based on the size and the brightness of that picture. There is an expression, put your past behind you. Now think of a memory that makes you feel bad and notice how you feel bad and how heavy it feels inside of you. Your heart might race. Now at that picture, if it's in color, now go ahead, close your eyes and make it black and white and then move it away from you. Make it dim. Close the picture down and make it dim, make it dim, make it fade. And then now that's an example of how you shift modality and what you see, make it the picture dim or maybe what you hear, make it a mute, silent movie of that pass. So then, guys, I am Rose, and I'm the hypnotist at Southeast Hypnosis. This is a great time to like my video so that others will get this message and able to view this video. Now, I'm Rose. I am the hypnotist at Southeast Hypnosis. You can find me at southeasthypnosis.com. Call me at 281-996-8000 for that free screening. Accepting hypnotist 281 9968000
Call me. You're going to be a hypnotist for fun and profit.